Hello everybody, welcome to the vlog, welcome back to Panier, and we are May the 4th, may the 4th be with you, and we are, um, yeah, just at the end of May, and yeah, I haven't had a great deal to do, to be honest, I, yeah, I've been twiddling my thumbs a little bit, uh, we made some more cow feed, um, so that's been done, uh, cows are doing well, we've got quite a bit of manure, Forming a bit of slurry, uh, a little bit more milk, um, about 1,900 litres of milk or something like that, so nothing really to deliver. Um, and yeah, I haven't really done a great deal else, uh, to be honest. We had a bit of a tidy up, and yeah, just basically got some fruit and uh, some juice, but that's about it. So what we're going to do, we're going to sell this stuff and the the dealership <laughs> has another another deal for me but um, it's whether I want to take it now it's going to mean and my in ambition was always to turn this um, sort of antiquated farm into a bit more of a modern farm uh, so yeah they have a a new Holland T8 on offer for us for sale. Now it is a huge tractor, um, probably a bit big for this farm, but it's uh, if we want to expand and get bigger, then it kind of makes sense to trade in the Arion for that, um, and that will give us uh, a couple of sort of smaller to medium sized tractors and a big tractor and it will easily pull um, all the equipment we've got as well but it also allows us to trade these things up eventually and yeah just yeah get bigger and better equipment and yeah hopefully for contracts and things like that so I think we'll probably go for it but but uh, we've got uh, a bunch of stuff to sell, so we'll go and do that first, uh, and then yeah, we can get on with uh, with the rest of it. So first things first, we'll go and sell the mustard. Um, this is the last little bit of mustard left over um, from our uh, shop, so I thought I'd sell that, and then yeah, we'll get the the apples and the mustard, um, apples and apple juice sold as well. So may as well get all these things sold, and then uh, yeah, hopefully that'll take us some way towards uh, buying this tractor. Now the other thing is, um, I did a another half um, couple of fertilising contracts as well um, while you were away, and that has given us. Uh, a little of the drip of income, so we're now sitting on 70,000 euros. So I'll nip in here, we'll uh, get the mustard sold, and uh, we'll give you a total. Okay, 1,285 euros for the mustard. And then what we'll do, we'll get this round to our little stall and we'll get this sold or we'll get it in for sale and uh, yeah we'll give you a total of how much all that's worth as well. Whoa! Blimey! Why'd you slam your brakes on me? Doesn't seem that bothered. Oh dear. Right. Park the other side of the road as I usually do. And uh Yeah, we'll get uh get all this sold, shall we?
Okay, so we've got 67,000 in total for that little lot, um, which is pretty good going, I think. So I think what we'll do now, uh, we'll turn the beacon off as well. I'm going to leave that there for now. And what we'll do, we'll run round, we'll grab the Arion. And yeah, we'll go and see what the dealership will will give us for this and um, yeah hopefully hopefully it all works out uh, yeah we'll go this way all right so I'll see you up there and um, yeah hopefully it should all work out. As it stands, um, I have enough money in the bank to buy it outright, but yeah, it doesn't leave us with much money in the bank at all. So yeah, if I can uh, trade this in, it's going to be it's going to be the way to do it, I think. And it also means that we will have a tractor that's mm, strong enough to um, yeah, pull our new trailer no problem at all as well because this tra tractor is a little bit on the small side um, so yeah all good right I will see you in a couple of seconds and um, yeah we'll get uh, see what they're gonna give us for this okay so the deal is done I have now 46,000 euros in my bank account but it's getting delivered, so here it comes. Uh, they're just getting it from uh, one of their other sheds, but the uh, person's just dropping it off for us, which is great. Um, yeah, so here it is. T8. Absolute beast. 350 horsepower, plus the weight. So, yeah, all told it was about €128,000 to buy. But we got 60,000 uh, 60, back off the Arion, so... Uh, Sorry, 56,000 off of the Arion, so all good. So, there it is. Very nice indeed. And, uh, yeah, quite the tractor. It's got 20, 20 hours on this, so it's not too bad. Our, our tractor had 30 odd on it, so, yeah, pretty good. Right. What I think we'll do, I'll get this back to the farm uh, and then, yeah, we'll probably potter again for the rest of the day and then, yeah, we'll probably see you 1st June and, um, yeah, we'll see where our fields are at, shall we? Everything's not quite there yet, it's just, um, still needs a little bit more time. Right, you can get into here and uh, yeah, go and park this up somewhere. Got quite a quite a nice uh, set of equipment now, but this will this should sit nicely on here. How's that looking? Yeah. That seems quite a good size tractor for that uh, trailer, actually. So I think, yeah, it's going to work, isn't it? Definitely going to work. Good. Right, we will see you in a little bit. Okay, June the 1st. And yeah, there's still not a lot to do. Uh, I've been topping up uh, or sorting out pallets, but... Um, so we've got a few more apples and juice pallets there um, but there's really not much to do things are growing everything's looking good so this is a uh, grown on another stage and our um, triticale is definitely getting there but uh, it's going to be another month till all this is ready so I think well I've taken on a cultivating contract we'll go and get on with that and use the the put the t8 to the test see how it gets on um and yeah i think yeah once that is uh once that is done 
yeah we'll see where we're at but let's get this started up oh it is nice in here I do like this right let's go this way and basically this is up past our spelt field this uh, this contract so kind of makes sense to go and have a look at that while we're there as well so we'll do that and uh, yeah hopefully uh, it won't take us too long so now the sheep have uh, moved on I don't this uh, patch of land that we've got over here is a bit surplus to requirements um, I was tempted to put uh, a sheep barn in there of some sort uh, for next winter uh, but yeah I think we'll just leave it for now and uh, yeah concentrate on uh, the summer and uh, get all these uh, crops sorted but yeah I think well we've got one two three four fields to harvest plus the grass fields as well so uh, we're gonna have quite a bit of work to do uh, over the over the summer into, and into the autumn and then yeah once we're all harvested I think yeah we'll move on after that but uh, just going to park here a second. Quickly have a look at how our spelt's looking. Looking pretty good. Um, yeah, it's a little way off as well, isn't it? But ooh, but um, not to worry, as they say. So I think the field in question is this one up here. which is, or was, alfalfa, so obviously the farmer no longer wants it. So we'll get into position here. There we go. Drop that down. And away we go. So I'm hoping this will pull a bit better um, because yeah the old Aryan definitely struggled a little bit with this um, this cultivator it was just a little bit heavy for it but this seems to be managing fine so the the right tractor for the job so got quite a long way to go so I think uh, what we'll do I'll um, get into position how's that looking on that side yeah it should be fine and uh, yeah, we'll just uh, keep going up and down this field and get it done, I guess. Um, I'll send the drone up for this one. We'll get a, get a view from above. And uh, yeah, hopefully we'll get this field finished. And 2,490, I think it was, for doing this for the farmer. So uh, not bad payment, really. It should do the job. Right. We'll see you in a few minutes, and uh, yeah, get this field finished. <laughs>
We are getting there. It's uh, not too big a field, but uh, it's taken a little while. But uh, yeah, we've done most of it. We've got uh, a couple of headlands to do, and uh, yeah, this last little triangle. So just continue on and get this done. But uh, yeah, it's, uh, the tractor is pulling this no problem. So it was definitely a, a lack of weight. Um, and power from the Aryan, I think, that was causing issues before. So, yeah, it's all doing good. So, I think we've probably got about another four passes, maybe, and then. Then we will. Uh, oh, Mr. Mr. Streak there. We'll come back and get that in a second. In fact, we'll do that little bit now while I uh, while I'm on it. And get that bit there. There we go. up to here and yeah as I said I think probably three more and then we are onto the headlands so yeah I hope everyone's well um, as I have mentioned on previous vlogs uh, yeah, the intention is to move farms at the end of this uh, this harvesting season, and uh, yeah, try try my hand at something I've never done before. So I think uh, it'll be good, and uh, hopefully you guys will continue watching the continue watching. Uh, a massive thank you to everyone that has uh, supported the channel over the years and uh, has recently joined as well. So great to have you on board, and uh, great to great to still have you guys that have been with me for a very long time as well. It has been a tough year, um, but things are getting there. Right. This is where it gets a little bit tricky in this corner. Should be alright. 
There we go. So, do you, in fact, I'll start in that corner down there, and we'll 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 run up the field this way, and then we'll finish back down at the road again. So, makes a bit more sense. All right. Okay. Up the field this way. Oh, that makes such a big difference having so much power. 350 horsepower makes a huge difference going up these hills. Uh, for hauling as well, it's going to be so much easier. So much easier. Yeah, it's holding a. Uh, Holding 15, 15 kilometers an hour there, no problem at all. So can't really complain. Right, get the rest of this done. Down to the bottom and. Uh, yeah, that'll be uh, the job done for the farmer, which is kind of good. And then, yeah, we'll head back down to the farm. And, yeah, I, I think, well, we'll have a look. Um, we'll probably bring the vlog back in at harvest time. Uh, so we'll get... Um, get the first lots of harvests on the way and then yeah hopefully hopefully we can um, yeah get uh, some spelt into the into the new dairy um, and in fact what we could do while we're at it. That's that done anyway. We'll go this way round uh, back to the farm and quickly check in on the dairy and see how um, see if we've got anything producing I guess. Um, we've got milk and butter not milk, I keep saying that, butter and cheese currently uh, producing in there so yeah let's go and have a quick look and see where we're at and then yeah I'll probably keep topping up that uh, that dairy uh, as time goes by I think there's a little bit more milk from the cows so that'll be a something to bring in uh, and then yeah as I said next vlog will be into harvest season hopefully Turn right here then, and let's go and have a look. I'm hoping, hoping we have something in there. There should be something. Let's have a quick scan. Right. Oh, we have, look at this, brilliant. So what have we got? What have we got here? So we have on to three butters and a cheese. That's good. Okay, so we can get the we'll get the tractor down to here and uh, I'm going to pick these up as well and get them sold. So yeah, maybe do that at the start of the next episode. But um, or I might just I might just sell it off screen. We'll see. Um. Right, we'll get back to the farm and I think, yeah, we'll finish the episode there. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, if you have done, don't forget to hit that like button. If you want to subscribe to the channel, please do. And if you want to share a comment, you are more than welcome to. Any comments, I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. What? These uh, cars just love to pull out, don't they? Uh, yeah, so, 
yeah, as I said, next one will be into harvest time, and um, yeah, very much look forward to seeing you all again soon. All the best.